obviously everything starts with a dream. I'm one of those kids who watch pro wrestling growing up. It's just something that I that I've watched since I was a child. I mean, first time I watched pro wrestling, I was only four years old. Every time when any teachers or my lecturers or anyone asked me what do you want to be when you grow up, I would always say that I want to be a pro wrestler. And I always get laughed at, I always get ridiculed because um, I mean, who wants to be a pro wrestler? Especially in Malaysia, there's no, there's no such thing. Uh, but I continued to keep that passion in my heart. So basically I started working, finished my studies and everything. But uh, deep down I still wanted to be a pro wrestler. So what I did was um, I flew to the States and then I trained um, pro wrestling there for just for three weeks. And I came back here with whatever I was able to learn within uh, three weeks and opened up my own pro wrestling school. What fuels me and motivates me is that it's just basically my passion I just keep on striving and driving through every obstacle to the way. The hate and the ridicule definitely fuels me. I mean, it just makes me want to prove everyone wrong that I can establish pro wrestling in Malaysia. I can teach pro wrestling. I can start a whole new scene. And that is exactly what I did. My PWs started off very slow. To be honest, um, when I first opened up my school, I only had um, four students back then. I mean, who in their right mind would keep on continuing a business where they have to fork out money from their own pocket just to keep, make sure it keeps on running? But um, I knew that um, these four students, they have the same dream as I. I figured that if I stop doing it, it would just crush their dreams and it would crush mine as well. So I just thought that I should pull out just for them. So um, after a year, we had our first show and it was very successful. And after that, it just grew exponentially. I mean, Malaysia Pro Wrestling is in a lot of major media. We are known now and uh, we have over like 40 plus thousand fans and followers from all over the world. So this just shows that if you put your heart into something, it'll happen. I mean, it's, it's a huge risk to bring something new, to do something new to Malaysia. It's just not pro wrestling, it's everything else, like for example, parkour or anything that is very difficult for society to accept. So I just decided to jump off the cliff and take a huge leap of faith to establish pro wrestling in Malaysia so people like me and my students can achieve their dreams to become a pro wrestler.